In this video, we are going to see the Scratch editor and what it does. Anyway, just a quick check. I've printed Scratch Cat, all these different colors. These two colors and these two colors seem the same. But if you do this, you, you can see the difference between this and this. Or between this and this. Anyway, now let's just go to the Scratch editor. And this is how the spread looks. We are going to do vector mode first. Later, we are going to learn about bitmap. Vector is just basically selecting. You can select scratch cat. You can disassemble a part scratch cat. Unfortunately, you can disassemble its head. But you can ungroup it and all right. <laughs> so this is our scratch bodies parts. This is also actually grouped so that we can remove that out. <laughs> All right, now this is the reshape. To do this, we're going to, let's just grab this eye over here. And we can drag this eye and change that shape to an eye like this. You can switch it to a curve. Or you can switch it to a pointer. Or you can just grab this circle, let's just say, and make it an arrow. You can also add points and have some fun reshaping. All right, now we'll go to the paintbrush. The paintbrush is basically, we'll just paint some color. Let's just say white and we'll paint it. Let's erase scratch cat. All right, this is the eraser. We can erase scratch cat like this as well and everything will turn into these curved lines. And this is a paint tool. I use it to actually paint scratch cut draft now, and we can do it to break. You see orange, so I think so it's best to do this. And now you see it red. Text is basically just putting text. For example, you can put, all right, let's just put it in. You can change the font, but I think so I prefer going with a non marker. And anyway, so we'll just put something like this, scratch. Cat. This uh, um, boat. You can just put something like this. Is how Scratch Cat looks like this assembled. Even though we've erased some of those body parts, and now it's a line. Line is basically drawing a line as well. But you can draw a line like that, or just randomly do some lights and circle is also basically a circle actually it's actually a oval but if you want to get a circle you will click shift button and now you get a circle and 
this is also the same, the rectangles will just make, uh, apparently it seems a bit too wide, doesn't it? And if you click whole shape, you'll get a square. Now let's do all this thing in bitmap mode. In bitmap mode, there's only this pen, which you can use to draw, and line, which is the same thing. Circles is also the same, except that you can choose whether you want a field circle or an outline circle. And you'll change the thickness one. Let's put it in. So rectangle is also the same. You can choose a field rectangle. Text the same. Fill is also the same. Select is pretty much the same, but it's not 100% the same. I like eraser. So you can select this part and start playing Lego. You can put this over here in this circle, and you can put this part over here, and you can really disassemble things. Alright, so that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. If you like it, please subscribe.